Hey guys, what's up? It's Josh. So for today's video, as you guys can see by the title, I wanted to talk about a couple different texts a guy will send you and what they actually mean. So in the past, I've done videos like this on my channel where I've told you guys what certain things mean when a guy does them. And I think that because communication and because texting somebody is so relevant right now, and you guys are probably texting a bunch of guys that you either like or that you know, I think that the responses that those guys give you are something that you can really like work off of if you're trying to find out if somebody likes you or just try to get somebody's vibe on how they feel about you. So in today's video, I'm gonna just go through a couple different responses that if a guy does send them to you, I think that I've broken it down enough in order to tell you guys what they actually mean. So if you guys enjoyed today's video, give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe button. But with that being said, here are a couple different ways you can tell if somebody likes you based on their responses that they send you over text. All right, so the first response or the first text that I wanna talk to you guys about is when a guy sends a simple hey. I think that there's a lot to be said by when people send you one word text. And I think that what it really comes down to is the amount of either exclamation marks they put or the amount of periods they put or the amount of extra letters they put at the end of a word. I'm sure you guys have seen those memes before where people talk about like when somebody says you hey and it has like three or four Y's after it. I think that if they're adding extra letters like that, it definitely means that they're trying to get across a different message than just saying a simple hey. But I think that that also also goes for exclamation marks and periods because if somebody is like making a word that is so simple different and they're trying to add something to it I think that it's trying to show like some type of emotion or something that they're feeling that guy is kind of fishing for more of a conversation and he wants you to know that he's hinting towards something else so the second one that we're gonna talk about is when a guy says do you want to come over I think that this kind of has a bunch of different meanings to it but I think that it really depends on the situation that you're actually texting him so it depends on what time it is. It depends on how you guys left your last conversation or what it was like when you last saw him. I think that if you left the guy in like a really good mood and you guys were talking about how you wanna hang out next or you guys wanna like do something that's more intimate and you don't wanna be like in a group of people, then I think that if a guy texts you and says, hey, do you wanna come over? I think that it can be more of like a booty call or it can be him wanting to show that he has more feelings for you than just wanting to hang out. Now, I think what's also a big part of this is like what time he sends that type of message. I think that if it's in the morning and like you guys are maybe like you just woke up and you're going to like get coffee or you're going to hang out and do something and he asks you if you want to come over, then obviously I don't think that that's kind of like he's asking you to come over as more of a booty call. <laughs> I think it's just that he wants to actually hang out and go and do something. Whereas I think if it's like late at night and he sends you a text like that, there's more like you can kind of just piece it together and it's kind of like common sense that he doesn't want you to just come over and hang out. There, there's something else there that he's trying to get across. So yeah, that's the next one. It could be a booty call or it could be him just wanting to hang out. All right, so the next one is when a guy sends you a text and it just says, hey, I have a random question. I think that basically what happens is sometimes when guys don't know what to say to a girl that they like or they don't know how to like send a text and start a conversation, one thing that they'll do is they'll send you a question or they'll be in some kind of situation where they need your help. And I think that a guy will do that if he is kind of confused and he is maybe a little bit nervous like if you have multiple guys saying like random questions to you like hey have you seen this movie before or like hey have you ever been to this place have you ever done this have you ever seen this they want to talk to you they just don't really know how especially if this is a guy that maybe you don't have a really long relationship with and you're just getting to know him I think that guys will try to find those little loopholes and little ways to start little conversations that then bring up more meaningful things and then you guys are actually actually having real conversations. So yeah, that is the third one. So moving on to the next one, which is guys complimenting girls in text. I think that there's a bunch of different ways that guys will do this and there's a bunch of different reasons why guys will send you a bunch of compliments or compliment on something that they really like about you. I mean, if you guys are talking about something and then you guys are laughing and it's a funny conversation and then he says like, hey, I think you're really funny. You might not think of that as being like a huge compliment, but I think that like those little compliments eventually you'll start to notice that like he'll be doing that all the time and then when you start to notice that like he's saying that you're funny and he thinks that you're cute and he really likes how you look and all these different things and you start piecing them together you'll start to realize that like this person actually has a lot of feelings for you and the meaning of those texts is because that's what he's trying to show you he's trying to let you know that he actually does care about you so if you do have a guy that's sending you texts <laughs> and he's saying like a bunch of compliments and he's saying that you're funny and you're cute and all this stuff 
I think it's really easy to like think like, okay, he obviously likes me. But sometimes when you're having conversations with people, you won't really recognize it or realize it. So that's the next one. If he is complimenting you, the meaning behind those texts is because he's wanting you to know that he really likes you. All right, so the next one that I wanna to talk to you guys about is when a guy sends you a good night text. I think that there's a lot that has to be said about when somebody texts you good morning and good night. And the reason that I say that is because I don't think you send people those specific messages when you don't actually like have feelings for them. I think that when you do text somebody good morning, what it really means is that when you're waking up, you're thinking of that person first. And I think that like the person on the receiving end of that text also sees that like, okay, they're texting me good morning and that means that they just woke up and it shows like, okay, that person's starting their day and they literally are texting me first. Or a similar, like if you're saying good night to somebody, it just means that you're wanting them to know that you're thinking about them at night before you go to sleep. I don't know, there's just some kind of like, hidden message there that's showing that like they actually have feelings for you. So when you do get a text from a guy and he's saying good morning or good night, really look at the situation and realize that he's sending you those messages because he wants you to feel something and he wants you to get the hint that he's trying to give you about him having feelings. So if you do get those kind of texts, let me know in the comments because I feel like a lot of us kind of look past them, but at the same time, like they are like super meaningful and people don't send those texts to everybody that they talk to. So yeah, that is the fifth one. The last one that we're gonna talk about is when a guy sends you a GIF or he sends you a photo or he sends you a video, anything like except just a word message. I think that what guys are trying to do by that is get a reaction out of you and they're trying to get you to pay attention to them. I think actually a really good way in order to start a conversation and to get somebody either laughing or feeling a certain way is to send them one of those GIFs or send them a message or send them a funny meme. It kinda gets like the conversation going and especially if it is like a super funny meme or something then it can totally make your day and make you realize that that other person is just trying to get attention from you. Yeah, that's another one. I think that a guy will send that to you if he is trying to get attention from you and he is trying to get you like in a certain mood to make you feel good. So that is the last one. So any of you guys that are watching this video, if you do have somebody that is texting you and you're not really sure how to respond or you don't really know what their texts mean, leave those down in the comments so that we can go through and try to answer them together. I think a lot of you guys do have questions out there. So if you want us to try to help you answer them, then you can always leave them in the comments and we'll go through and try to help as many as you as we can. But I think that this is like an interesting topic to talk about because a lot of you guys are texting people that you like. And I think that there's a bunch of different ways to text someone and a bunch of different meanings that come from certain texts. So, so if you guys did enjoy today's video, give it a thumbs up. If you guys do have any other video suggestions that you guys want to see, I will try to make videos out of like the questions that you guys send me. So like I said, if you guys are new to my channel, hit the subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, or if you just want to give it a thumbs up. <laughs> And if you guys do want to go subscribe to my other channels, I will have them linked in the description. I upload videos on those ones like once a week as well. So you guys will get a bunch of extra content if that's what you're into. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I love you guys so much. And as always, I will see you guys next Saturday in next week's video. Bye. After you. <laughs> Hi, mom. <laughs> you got to take your jacket off to fit back there. Yeah, dude. <laughs> it doesn't fit otherwise. <laughs>